Welcome back to Van's Kitchen. Today's recipe is a dessert. We are going to see how to prepare a very yummy bread pudding without egg. Let's get into the video. Two and a half cup milk, quarter teaspoon cinnamon powder, half cup brown sugar, three to four tablespoons butter, three tablespoons custard powder, one cup milk powder. I'm using milk powder that has sugar. That's the reason I'm using half cup brown sugar. In case you are using a milk powder without sugar, you can add extra brown sugar or also white sugar. Half cup chopped almonds and cashew nuts. Half teaspoon vanilla essence. A pinch of salt. Six to seven white bread slices depending upon the thickness cut into small squares. In medium heat, add butter to a pan first followed by chopped nuts. Roast the nuts until they are slightly golden brown and remove 3 4 of the nuts from the pan. Now add milk to this. Add custard powder, milk powder, sugar, cinnamon powder and salt. Mix everything well together. Keep mixing for 4 to 5 minutes until the mixture gets thick. Once it gets nice and thick, Turn off the heat and add vanilla essence to it. Add chopped bread pieces to this mixture and mix well and let it sit for 2 minutes. Apply butter to a baking pan and transfer the mixture to the baking pan after a couple of minutes. Sprinkle all the roasted nuts and some cinnamon powder on top. Bake this in 350 degree Fahrenheit preheated oven for around 30 minutes. After around 20 minutes, remove it from the oven and check it. If you think it's burning on the top, you can cover it with aluminum foil and continue baking. After around 30 minutes of baking, bread pudding will be ready. Sprinkle some icing sugar on top if you wish. Let this sit down for a few minutes before you start cutting into pieces. Bread pudding will get firmer as it cools down. Cut it into pieces and serve it with ice cream or as such and enjoy. Try this very simple yet very delicious dessert. If you guys like my recipes, please like, share, comment and subscribe. Thank you.